Please get ready for dictation of a passage from the NCERT 10th class book of physical education. It is titled as Physical Education Relationship with Other Subjects. Start. Play is spontaneous. It is usually a creative activity but has its own limitation and space. One plays voluntarily for fun and pleasure. Play, however, is a broad area which includes both games and sports. The distinctive features of play are that they are free, separate, uncertain, governed by self-rules and creative. Generally, the word games and sports are used together. A game is an activity involving more players defined by a goal that the player tries to reach and some set rules to play. By masses, games are played primarily for entertainment or enjoyment. The difference of purpose differentiates sport from game combined with the notion of individual or team skill. Games are also played on the basis of a set of rules. A game is defined as a goal that the players try to achieve. A person who participates in a game is known as a player. A sport is a physical activity carried out under an agreed set of rules for competition or self-enjoyment or a combination of these. Sport are the kind of activities in which similar kind of body movement is repeated over a long time. For example, swimming and running and almost all the track and field events come under sport. Sport involves an activity or activities where the mental capabilities of the sports person are judged. In a sport, it is the sports person or the individual who determines the outcome. A person participating in a sport is called an athlete or a sports person. Health and ed physical education classes provide space for exploring new ideas related to personal and community health. These ideas might then be used by students in various other fields of learning such as arts, science, civics and citizenship, communication, design, creativity and technology and languages, for example, English, Hindi and other regional languages, humanities, for example, history, geography, economics, etc., information and communication, technology and psychology. Health and physical education. Teachers can incorporate activities related to performing arts, drawing, painting, dance, drama, media, music and visual communication into their programs. These involve both fine motor skills and whole body movement, including rhythmic, rhythmic movement. As body movements are part of both arts practice and health and physical education, these promote health knowledge, understanding of the body and lead to physical fitness and enhancing of creative skills at the same time. The human body is a common concern of both science and health and physical education. In science, students study the human body from the cellular level to the systems level with a focus on anatomy and physiology. In health and physical education, learning is focused on the requirements for good health and the promotion of a healthy body. Students gain an understanding of the role of physical and yogic activities in ensuring good health and can link the functioning of the musculoskeletal, digestive, endocrine and nervous systems studied in science for the promotion of the physical, social, mental and emotional health of individuals within a society. Students consider it their personal responsibilities to discuss and adopt health issues both in relation to their own safety and well-being as well as to the safety and well-being of others. 
It also contributes in the designing of training for movements, movements of organs to achieve optimal performance in the area of play, sports and games. Social sciences promote the idea for citizens require knowledge and understanding of civic institutions and the skills and willingness to actively participate in functioning of the society. Similarly, in health and physical education, students are encouraged to become active and responsible members of their community. Key concepts within health and physical education classes include understanding of the importance of personal identity within a community, what makes a community and how to engage with different members and agencies within a community. Participation in physical activity and sports also reflect values, rules, rights and responsibilities indicative of a democratic society. Communication involves developing knowledge, skills and behaviors that empower students to respond to, make meaning of and deconstruct a range of communication forms. Effective communication is a key skill in health and physical education. It is essential that students develop the ability to listen, view and respond with respect to the content and tech context in which communication happens. Learning in the health and physical education domain involves developing familiarity with forms, language and conventions used in different forms of public, personal and interpersonal communication. Design, creativity and technology help in developing sport goods, sport wear, sport software program, etc. These are associated with knowledge and promotion. In this area, students learn about the characteristic and properties of how all these aspects differ from each other. These investigations assist students to make decisions about appropriate solution. Students analyze and evaluate factors such as social, cultural and economic factors that influence design, creativity and technology. Stop.